Good evening and thank you for joining us tonight. I'm Linda Larson. Now we're hearing new calls for peace in Ukraine and they're from our neighbors. Tonight, some have a very personal interest in what's happening in the European country. Braden Wilson explains what brought dozens of our neighbors out to the streets of Idaho Falls today. This group of Ukrainians are gathered here on the Memorial Drive Bridge in downtown Idaho Falls. They say they just want to have us hear their stories. It's very hard time for everybody now over there. Sergei tells us many have come to him to offer any support they can. It's of course difficult to help, but uh, many, many neighbors come to us with their solidarity with Ukraine and uh, they are praying for us. Melania is from Kiev, a city under siege. She organized this rally. She says her friend left a chilling text with her just hours before the rally. My friends uh, were able to get out. Some did, some didn't. And the last time I spoke to one of my friends was at least five hours ago. And she said, I don't know when I will text you next, but if anything happens, I love you. She says their message to the people is pretty simple. Please stop this war. Nobody has to die. Please. Melania and her friends on the bridge say it's hard for them to be there, not knowing if their families are safe. Reporting in Idaho Falls, I'm Braden Wilson.